you still chopping corn silage, feeding dairy cows? We like to use the Beck's PFR book for some data research stuff, third party. One of the tests that are in there that I really like to look at here is the one with a plant growth regulator that's got gibberellic acid in it. They're applying it at a V5 stage. In the study here, the tonnage that they were pulling off of this, the controlled was 22.5 tons. The controlled. With the V5 pass, with this PGR, it was 25.25 ton. That's 2.75 ton more. That's a good way to be able to cut back on, on some of your acres. You got to chop and be able to combine a little more and maybe be able to make a, a profit on hauling that to the to the elevator and get some cash out of it but a lot of people are asking well okay you gain more ton what else did you gain well they gain more dry matter and yield the the starch is higher in it the cool thing is is they took this the milk production and they were able to get some more milk out of the cows by having a healthier silage that they were chopping and also with beef they were able to put more tons on or more pounds per ton when they were feeding into that beef if you guys are looking for maybe an option of an easy gain in your pocket for some corn silage put the word pfr in the bottom and somebody from our team reaching out to you have a good one